Hi, I'm Cami Grovner, President and CEO at Inland Valley Hope Partners. I wanted to thank you for this opportunity to express our appreciation for all your support over the years of our mission to feed the hungry and shelter the homeless. Um, your alternative Christmas program is one of our favorite programs to participate in every year, and so we were very pleased to hear you were continuing that this year. 2020 has been challenging, I think, for all of us, but for so, so many of the children and families that we serve, it's been absolutely devastating. Sadly, far too many of our neighbors are struggling to keep their children fed and even to keep a roof over their heads. But the good news is that with your help, we here at Inland Valley Hope Partners are here to provide those basic needs. We do this through our food security program, which provides about a four to five day supply of food every 30 days for the entire household. Um, we also do some fresh produce and other supportive services there. But with everything that's going on, all this craziness, in November, we're gonna actually expand this assistance to serve families twice per month. So we're excited to see how that works out. Also, our housing program, it provides emergency temporary housing plus supportive services to families and single women experiencing homelessness. Um, it's designed to build the skills and resources these families need to stabilize and secure and maintain permanent housing. We also offer, a lot of people don't know, but we have homeless prevention rental assistance for families that are behind in their rent and are struggling. And this assistance has been absolutely critical this year as so many people are experiencing unemployment and financial instability. Um, and so this program really has been a lifeline for people in our community. I have to say that the support of people like you in the community this year has been absolutely amazing and we would not have been able to sustain our services and meet the increased demand for those services in the community this year without your support. And so I just want to say thank you. Thank you so very much from the bottom of my heart and on behalf of all of our staff and volunteers and those we serve. And also I pray you remain safe and have a happy and blessed holiday season.